So we've been on a little adventure today, all the way from Liverpool to a beautiful town in Yorkshire. Two trains, one vintage bus ride later, yeah, and, nice. and we found these blokes. Gary, tell us why we're here today. So it's the spiritual home of Calendar Girls. Um, and I must say, it's been great because we've got a whole new cast for this show. And it's been really lovely introducing them, not only to the original Calendar Girls that we've had here, but also just to this area. So we're going on tour, so we start right around the country and we're coming to Liverpool end of November nice. at the Empire. I'm thinking it's going to be a bit of a tearjerker for, for the Scouts crowds when they see this show, Tim. Tell us what we can expect. Well, uh, somebody once said when they first, the show came out that it, it was the first time that they'd ever craft in a theatre and they said it's crying and laughing at the same time and the, the story is ultimately incredibly uh, optimistic. But the truth is that the emotional bits, the bits that make people cry, and I've sat there, we haven't, but we, we watched in the, from the box, it's not early on when, when a character dies. Actually, that's not what's as emotional as the hope and the friendship that brings them out of it. And it's, it's really odd that it's the, uh, it's the optimism that is more moving. So when people say they've cried at this show, it isn't actually tears of grief. It's oh, tears of, yeah, it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a joyous thing. Well, how lovely as well to keep this story alive. And meeting the ladies today, meeting lovely Beryl and, and, and the ladies. It, it must be brilliant for you guys to be able to do that. Incredibly important, I think, to what we're trying to do with this show, to tell the story, is to really know where it comes from, what the heart of it is. And, and also, you know, there's a amount of responsibility for us because these they're alive and they're here and they they tell us what they like what they don't like and it and it is brilliant it's, it's lovely to have them a part of it what do we think of Liverpool? what do we think of the city i know you're a footy fan as well um yes well i've obviously been my mum was from walton so uh, we've always had a strong connection to liverpool i've played there myself in gigs we've had the band musical there recently by the way. which everyone you know we've got so many lovely messages uh, that you know we're, we're dying to take this show to town as well what has happened to Liverpool is unimaginable in the last 10 years. So now all our kids, they all go to Liverpool and that's within the space of one generation. Yeah. I want to see you both for a pint in November. Okay. Gary, hey, thank Tim, you, thank Enjoy. you so Enjoy. much. Enjoy. Calendar Enjoy. Girls, the musical thank is coming. You.